Hey there, so in this video we're going to talk about how to set up the navigation bar color in Optimize Press. Now Optimize Press is a theme with WordPress where you basically set up the pages and you adjust those settings, you add that banner or the header and you adjust the colors of the navigation bar and all that stuff and then whatever you set up you need to go back and then set up the same thing for the blog section. I'm not really sure why it does it that way, it's just the way this particular theme Optimize Press works. So to do that, when you log into the site of Optimize Press, you're going to see on the side here, Optimize Press. You're going to go to Blog Settings. I've opened it up here on another tab. So when I'm in Blog Settings, what you want to do is navigate to Layout Structure. Um, and when you're in Layout Structure, you would then click on, it's going to look like this, you're going to click on Header and Navigation Preferences. Now, I've selected this style because I want it to match the page that I've already created. And let me just show you that page now. So if I go back to pages, because we're going to use that as our guide, we're going to basically use the one page to be our, our main guide. Um, and this is the one, actually I'm going to, I'll probably just delete that one, but this is the one, the test page. I'm going to trash the sample page because that was just what came by default with WordPress. So I've created a test page that we want to use as our guide. If I look at it, you'll be able to see what I've done is added a banner, and I've set the colors here for this navigation bar. And then I added this content, right? This is just getting set up with initial content. Um, and then there's the footer, right? So if I would go to the blog page, it's going to look different. If I go over to the blog page, which I can do here, um, this is not it. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, I think it's just in your loneliness. Sorry. I think it's just that. <clears throat> and this is just the default blog. And what we'll see is that the navigation looks like that. And why is it red? It's because I haven't done anything. It's just the default. So we just need to adjust that. So you might want to have this open so you can kind of look. And we want it to make it look like this navigation bar. So what you got to do is basically go into the blog settings and you would go to layout structure and then you would scroll down. Now I've already added the banner so we don't need to do that, but you'd want to scroll down and then you're going to click on where it says blog primary navigation. So you click that and here is where you enter the color, right? So you see the colors that are here. That's not the colors we want, right? What we want to do is set up the same colors that are used on the page. So you keep this tab open. You go back to the page that's set up the correct way and you hit edit page. And then what you can do is you launch the live editor so we can look at it. And as it loads, you'll start to see this is the page that I've created so far. And this is going to be kind of our test page that we build everything off of. So once it's loaded, you can kind of see the elements that I've added here. And we're going to, you know, we can set up each page however we want. And we're actually going to end up cloning this page to make the other pages on the site. But for now, what you want to do is go over to color scheme settings, page color settings, navigation bar. And here are the colors. Those are the color codes that you need to copy and basically paste into the areas, the proper areas here. So just figure out like navigation, hover, link text. Go over here and find uh, hover link text. Let's see. Hmm. No, that's the text. Let's see. Hover link text is down here. Navigation, hover, link text. They're in a little bit different order. So you got to look first at like the name and find the name over here, right? So it's just, it's a little confusing because they're in a different order. But background, gradient, start color, you go over here and find background, gradient, start color. There it is, right? So you would copy this number and then you would go over here and you would paste it um, right in here. So you'd paste it in here. Whoops, that's not it. <laughs> you would copy this and then you would go over here and you would paste it in. And now, see, it's made the change. So once you've got them all set, you just hit um, save. And then you can refresh this main page, and you'll see that the navigation bar looks that color. So that's how you adjust the color of the navigation bar in both the blog area and the page area in Optimize Press.